Hi Scorpio, welcome back to another reading. Thank you so much for subscribing if you're a new person to the channel. And thank you so much for all your likes. If this resonates with you, appreciate it. Scorpio, let's get some reading done for you. Scorpio, Scorpio, energy. Scorpio, the Wheel of Fortune. Feeling the Wheel of Fortune right now. Really good, happy card. Oh, we do have something things you gotta let go. We got the Three of Swords in reverse. I'm gonna talk about that a little bit more. Oh, we got a Capricorn trying to give you some trouble. Capricorn wants revenge. Got a water sign also involved at the moment. Now, Scorpio, with the Wheel of Fortune, your destiny and your luck is ever present at the moment. It's very good. However, there is some there is a three of swords uh, in reverse. And that tells me I'm getting the energy of there's somebody or something that you gotta let go, okay? And from, from the betrayal, grief, or pain, or heartbreak that you're feeling, you gotta let that go because you gotta let it go. The reason why is because if you hold on to it, it's gonna overwhelm everything about you and your life. And there's a Capricorn that's, that's definitely around you at the moment. That's basically, they're feeling very, they want revenge and they're using their force. And, and this Capricorn possibly is definitely uh, not in a in a malicious or evil sense, but but definitely they want to have arguments with you because they want some revenge on something that from the past that um, made you look like a winner, and they they definitely didn't like that. So you got definitely got hater stuff going on behind the scenes, and also we got the Queen of Swords. And the Queen of Swords tells me that uh, there's a water sign um, that is basically protecting you with uh, good energy. And, um, and they're going to help you stand on your own. They're going to give you good advice. Um, the advice may not be super friendly, but it's good advice. And... Um, and they cut through everything and they see they see everything and they cut through the BS and they tell the truth. So if this uh, Queen of Swords is telling you about the uh, Capricorn, right? Take the advice. It's time to let go of that. Uh, let go meaning it's going to cause you more pain and grief. And... Your heart needs to heal at the moment. And the Wheel of Fortune is behind you. And it's been like that for a while now. And we are going to also do some Oracle cards that I put together here for you. Let's see what we got here. It's better to live a day as a lion than a hundred years as a lamb. Okay? This is all... Advice from spirit. Spirit, what else advice do you have? There's celebration, freedom, and excitement coming up. Okay. And what else do we have here? Balance and karma is, and justice is over, overwhelming, and it's coming. Okay. What else we got? The smarter you get, the lesser you speak, okay? That's some good advice right there. I'm gonna pull one more for you, Scorpio. Connection, truth, and attraction, okay? That's what I also got for you. These are the advice cards. 
Scorpio, I'm going to do lucky numbers, okay? Lucky numbers for you. We got 21, 4, 5, 28, 30, and 26. Okay, you got that? I'm going to repeat it. 21, 4, 5, 26, I'm sorry, that's 28, 30, and 26, okay? All right, so those are your lucky numbers.